wants to be with a chance to win on Sunday at PGA National. And we're taking a look at Woods here on the sixth hole with driver in hand. Well, it's one of the hardest driving holes on the PGA Tour. It's just very intimidating, and that speaks to a lot of things. One, <laughs> fusion works. Um, and that was a fusion of confidence and talent and technique, and then brawn followed by finesse. Finesse, the little sawed off nine iron. Luis is just into the fringe, but man, what two quality golf shots. I had people tweeting at me today saying, I've got a good back, but I want to have that surgery. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> I'm, I'm joking. It's, his fusion surgery could quickly become the Tommy John surgery of the PGA Tour. If it's, uh, it helps you like that. This is cool. You know, he's, he's, this is just a position shot. It's a different type of golf swing. You can tell he's trying to hit a cut, whereas on the sixth, he was trying to hit a draw. Um, I think he's taking it for a ride. He's taking the golf swing for a ride. You know, let's see what this thing can do. You know, can I hit every shot? Can I hit every trajectory? Well, yeah, you can. Here we see him again with just another little knockdown shot. Uh, power followed by finesse. <laughs> Rarely hit the same shot consecutively in the game of golf. And, and to be able to come out and do this uh, so quickly is mighty impressive. Yeah, tent hole, another look up the tee. Yeah, you want to hit a cut shot here. So, wow. His, his drives have been. 346, 361 yesterday, 335. All around the corner, all in perfect position. Just absolutely spot on. Again, I think he's just taking it for a ride, really enjoying it. And now at the 11th. This, I think, is actually probably one of the better shots he hit all day. Hmm. Just under 200 yards, 199 yards to control it, get clean contact out of that first cut of rough, get it to sit down on the green like that, settles into some 10 feet, uh, just a beautiful golf shot. And a par saving effort at 12, another big moment. Yeah, out of the right bunker, had to lay up, uh, pitch to 19 feet. And you know, that was, look, a long time ago, but remember the par save he made on Sunday, the US Open in 2016? How important it was to him? I mean, there was a little sense of that. It was just personal pride. I'm not gonna make a bogey dog on it. Another great reaction here by Tiger. This birdie putt disappearing at 13. He's walking it home. Great react. At that point, one under and four off the pace. He has been so steady. Woods now at the 15th, though. This is where the golf course gets him on edge. Well, it gets virtually everybody on edge. And, and really, through two rounds, there was two swings he made. The six iron into the third hole and the seven iron into the water there yesterday. And it's really not a big deal to see him kind of overcompensate like that. But this shot, uh, the position he was in, this was just uh, really incredible because you know what? To keep it out of the water from there and actually get it over the bunker uh, is, is a successful golf shot. And you see all those good shots and you think, well, where do these come from? Well, very often when you're working on a new golf swing and then you get into a position where you've got nerves and anxiety, you don't always know exactly how those two are gonna mesh up. This is a new golf swing for him. I mean, it's, it's you know, it'll make you nervous just standing there. But here again, he's got the full out flop. Uh, this lie, I think, was, you know, the one at, at, at 15, he could have gone under it and left it in the bunker. He could have hit it in the water, as David said. Um, this was brilliant, you know, absolutely brilliant. Get it on the green, he brought a smile to his face. Now trying to save par. Can walk this one in? Just not enough. So back to an over par score. Plus one. Woods at 18. Yeah, he swung really hard off of the tee. He'd hit good drives here the first couple of rounds. And this is, uh, this again speaks to his confidence, David. This is exactly what I was going to say. Playing this golf shot, having the belief in what you're doing from 240 yards out of the fairway bunker to give it a go, I think, is just incredible. And here we see another display of his chipping prowess. Low hook. Low. Why not? Just burn it through the rough. He's taking it high. He's taking it low. He's taking on pins. Yeah, he's I mean, short-sided. That's right. Think about the chip he had at 17, the difficulty of that chip, and then the 